boys trying to get that level four as well, so that he can contribute to this fight. But right now, Ooh. they're control the side of the turtle. Quite low. Looks like he's gonna be fine, but now fighting for the turtle. Yeah, Luffy has the final slash, can go for it, jumps into the vent as well, and that's gonna be the penalty on a lot. Albert down the good final slash combo in with the retribution. Now that's gonna be the spatial migration and the violent requiem locked down together. Good job to fight against CW using the Zalan Ford under the turret. Eventually goes down. Now gone too. The Fracture too, and now Albert will be able to use the dash, but now he's gonna try to bait Fugo into the turret. I'm not sure if Fugo wants to take this, and he does. Where did the Monic Force get pulled away, way too far away from this turret? He's forced to use the Purify, now it might be the re-engage from Albert catching what Fugo. What we saw in the previous games of Vietnam, struggling, and look at this, invading that purple buff. Razor Shrath and Retribution combo together. Violet Requiem, though, my goodness, Nart gonna be knocked up straight into the Fracture and a Dispersion. Now it's gonna be Luffy, this is gonna be confident. The Diversion gets placed down, and Sans will be able to escape. Keyboy next to the chopping blocks. They go for the chase, a demonic force as well. Keyboy will be able to enter again onto the Spatial Migration. Getting Joe knocked up. CW rotating back again as Joe goes over the top, but CW has rotated. Goes over the Synchro Fission, and it's gonna be Hehe. Completely, it's just too much. He's 7 0 1. Final Slash Synchro Vision right into the stacks. Albert, what triple kill! And now he's gonna go for more to Maniac waiting for him, and that's gonna be the spatial migration to knock him up to get Albert him is in. doing on this note 31,000 damage mid lane. Nart again, not having a good time, not even given the chance to use the Primal Wrath as CW jumps in forward, does have the Purify now, will be able to get locked down by the penalty zone, but that's going to be the Demonic Force munching out the Q-Boy's HP bar, as that will be Q-Boy falling down, Luffy with Vengeance, now with the stun as well, trying to bait out some of these Demonic Forces, and he's going to get the Purify, but will not be able to survive. side of your jungle, and even with this lineup, oh, again. Oh, I can't even say it was a spatial You can it down like that, and the diversion gets placed up top, Yandere. Oh no, you gotta start running, buddy. Albert is coming down now. He has the passive and the basic attack, and he won't even start to crumble here. It looks like you have to keep an eye on Keyboy. Oh! Stun into the... Oh my god, the final slash into the Violet Requiem. Well played, Indonesia, Lupi, and Keyboy. Working that synergy together, penalty zone, blocking Keyboy and Sans there, but he has Purify, Yandere just gets bursted down, I think by Albert on the Fracture, and now again it's Hehe, <laughs> isolated all alone with the rest of the members having to flee from the Fracture, CW dashing forward, still has his on Force as well, it's gonna be Luffy with a final slash again, Whoa. connecting on a 2, forcing the Purify on his mark, finally gets the Primal Wrath, but not for long, it's just to survive for one last, you know, bit of damage from CW to take him down. Yandere, Joe, and Fugo on the defense. Albert level 15, jumping in Fracture. Oh my goodness! Fugo disappearing again. The assassin is assassinating anyone in that Ripsy boy! With a spatial migration, get the Violet Requiem too. And that's the combo together with the dispersion. Indonesia gonna get things done before the 10th minute of the game. Holy moly.